I'm at the ST stand here at Embedded World 2014 and I'm joined by Patrice Amard, who is the marketing manager for the microcontroller division. It's a very grown up title, but at the moment he's reverting to his childhood. So tell me a bit about this demo. Absolutely, this is, this is a lot of fun. It's a demo that is, uh, in fact, a product built by Anki Drive uh, that is incorporating the uh, STM32 F0 inside. Uh, you can control the car. Uh, with the uh, iPhone or iPad, with a software which is embedded in the uh, iOS. It's called Artificial Intelligence, uh, linked to the car through a Bluetooth interface. Well, talk to me about the serious stuff, the STM32 F0. Yeah. STM32 uh, F0 is embedded inside. Uh, it uh, receives the information from the optical sensors and is going to take control of the uh, wheels to drive the car speed up, uh, slowing down, and uh, uh, steering the car. Then you will have the possibility to download additional features through the uh, RF interface, and you have a permanent connection between the car and the AI. So the STM32 F0 is a uh, series that you have introduced uh, a year ago, and we are permanently uh, enriching with new uh, part number. Uh, it goes from a 16K byte uh, flash 20 pin to 120K uh, byte uh, flash with 100 pin. Uh, this device is covering a lot of applications uh, from very, very low end up to medium end. Uh, 8 bit, 16 bit kind of uh, uh, domain are covered now with this family. Um, it, uh, <coughs> it has a lot of peripheral. Advanced peripheral, it goes up to 48 megahertz, so you have the performance of the device. Uh, you have the DMA, which is able to handle uh, independently the communication from peripheral to memory, peripheral to peripherals. Then you have a lot of power inside these small micros. You're breaking low cost barriers here. Is it also suitable for 8 bit applications? Absolutely. So it goes so low now in, uh, in price that we are stepping into the uh, 8 bit. Uh, uh, arena. Last uh, summer we made an announcement with the uh, STM32 at uh, 32 cents, which is demonstrating the possibility to uh, be at that level, stepping into the 8-bit uh, domain. Um, the uh, STM32 uh, F0 uh, is covering a wide range of applications, but not only this, there is a possibility to upgrade to a Cortex M4 and to uh, climb the uh, ladder of a uh, performance from M0 to M4 while we can keep the uh, software used for communication interfaces, for example. Patrice, lovely to talk to you, but it's my go. Where's the controller? Thanks. The controller is here. <laughs>